What's up guys, I'm TGM and today I'm going to show you how to put together a clarinet. First of all, here's a reed. So what you're going to do is take the reed out of the case, put that in your mouth. And you're going to keep that, you're going to keep the reed in your mouth the entire time you put together your clarinet because your reed needs to be wet for it to play the instrument. Alright, so putting the clarinet together, I have to start with the mouthpiece. So, this is the mouthpiece. Uh, the reed is going to go here, and this is, and the reed's going to vibrate when you blow, and that's what's going to make the clarinet play. Um, and there's this piece, uh, I forgot the name of it. Uh, it's a ligature. That's the name of it, a ligature. So, um, yeah, so you're going to put the V, uh, you're going to put the ligature down because you don't need it. So, you take the mouthpiece, and then you're going to take the barrel, and you're going to put these two together. All right, so when you put the mouthpiece and the barrel on, see this little like wood looking part you're gonna have to uh find the spot that it fits in so my clarinet has a little like v on the vivo with a brand as that it is uh and that's gonna be up so the bottom part too big doesn't fit so the top part so what you're gonna do you're gonna have to, you're gonna twist it on and push don't push in a little break they'll, they'll break the clarinet uh, but you're just gonna turn it and twist it until it lines up with the mouthpiece. It's like that. Um, and now let me show you the other parts. All right, so there's the upper joint and the lower joint. The lower joint always have these four keys right here. The upper upper joint has the this A note up here has this and it also has this long key with this little hole uh so this is the upper key upper up, up, the, up, the upper joint and um yeah so let's put these together all right so um the upper joint has this little piece here that this little, uh, little circle here that will fit in this little divot in the lower joint. So, you, so yeah, again, you're going to twist it in. So when it gets to that point where that circle is, you're just going to align that up and just kind of move it around. And then it's together. So this is the, like, the body of the clarinet. Um, and then you take the mouthpiece and the barrel and you take the top joint and you see how it has that little symbol on it of the brand so you're just gonna twist you're just gonna twist that on until until it aligns up until the those two symbols align up together just like this and so now we're almost done then gonna take the bell this is the bottom of the clarinet Let's take this ligature and let's finish putting together the clarinet. All right, so when you put the bell on, um, see the bottom joint has that symbol, it's kind of hidden, uh, and the bell has it. So it's really easy. You just, um, just twist it on, then align it, and you finish the, and you finished putting the uh, base, the body of the clarinet on. Finish building that. Now let's, now let's finish the mouthpiece so it makes some sounds. Okay, so that mouthpiece, that's, that should be in your mouth still. Um, take it out of your mouth so it's nice and wet. So when you put the reed on, Shouldn't be too low. It won't make any sound if it's too low. Can't be too high or it won't make a sound. 
these are fragile. These uh, reed, the reeds are fragile. Uh, they're made of bamboo. Um, but if you don't put it uh, in the right spot, it'll break and you will have a bad day. Um, so when you put it together, make sure. So we make make sure to align it to the top. So make sure to align it to the top so it makes that so and so it makes that sound. If it's too low, the air will just flow right through the clarinet. If it's too high, it's not gonna make any sound and your mouth will break the reed. So make sure to align it in like right in the middle. So like put you can put your finger there, like right there, and so that's or you put the reed. You take that ligature that's been laying down, waiting to be used for like a while. Uh, you take this and uh, you take where these little screws are, put that uh, in the back or in the top of the clarinet. Then you can then then you just adjust the reed to your liking, and uh, then you can loosen it. So lefty loosey, righty tighty. Uh, you loosen the, the screws. Then once it's on right, you put it together. You, I mean, you tighten it, and you finished putting together your clarinet. Um. So, I've been playing the bass clarinet for a while, so I haven't played clarinet in a while, so it might squeak. Alright, so it works. Um, I'm gonna have some more uh, tutorial videos on how to not squeak. Um, and also, one last thing, you could get uh, these bell covers to put over your oh oops to put over your uh bell and so it and so it does so spit doesn't go everywhere because of covid and all that stuff but yeah that's how you uh put together a clarinet so i'm gonna make some now i'm gonna make a tutorial on how to not squeak uh, make sure to like and subscribe and put in the comments on what songs you would like me to hear. Uh, have a nice day and stay safe.